Brie with mascarpone cheese and dried fruit is the perfect thing to bring to a gathering or serve as an appetizer before a special evening. I once saw this in a cheese shop for an outrageous price and guess what? I'm the copycat lady so we're going to make it up for you. We're going to begin with brie mascarpone cheese. If you've never used it, it's a lot like cream cheese but it's sweet and it's softer and dried fruit of your choice. You could do some toasted nuts in here but um, whatever you like here. I'm just using regular dried fruit. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm only going to use part of this wedge of brie. If you have a lot of people, you may want to use the whole thing. Um, it really doesn't matter what the shape looks like because we are going to coat this with mascarpone cheese and dried fruit. So the shape it is now is not what it's going to be like a little bit later. So we're simply going to cover this with mascarpone cheese and you can see how soft and creamy it is. Now, another use from mascarpone cheese is cannolis. Um, I love cannolis made with mascarpone cheese. It's so smooth and creamy and um, it's a real delight to use. So here we go. We're just covering it all the edges with this and next comes the dried fruit and you're just going to press the dried fruit into the mascarpone cheese and just try to get it everywhere. This is a wonderful easy dish to make so of course you know my presentation there doesn't look too pretty so I'm gonna put this on a more attractive dish and there you go there is brie with mascarpone cheese and dried fruit and hey for more recipes come to copycat.com